and you do have a pulmonary embolism in the lungs, but these are very treatable conditions and you're going to live a long and healthy life. I know this is a lot to digest. And do you have any questions for me? Thank you, Dr. Goldhamer. Yes, before I go, do you have any tips on how to prevent future DVT or PE? Kelly, that's a great question. When you're on a plane, be sure to stretch your legs out. Get up every couple hours. Aisle seats are recommended. If you can't get up, point and flex your toes. Gotta keep your vessels flowing forever. Anything you can do to keep a clot from forming. Even if you eat real well, even if you exercise, could be at risk still, babe. And I don't want to clot a vein. If you hurt yourself, beware of immobilization. Your risk increases from inflammation. You might need anticoagulation that the doc prescribes to keep your blood flowing. Might even be long term on a doac forever, forever and ever. Even if you eat real well, even if you exercise, you'd be at risk still, babe. And I don't want a clot of it. You don't want a thrombosis. Don't want any emboli. You just have to be prepared, yeah, just in case. Know the signs. I know all my risk factors Come on and check my D-dimer Won't be anticoagulated For all the rest of time Yeah, yeah, yeah I don't want a DVD I don't want a PE Don't wanna call a vein. Don't wanna call a vein.